so today, I, it's been a while since I posted, it's like a couple of years, but I, why not? So I'm going to fix these pair of glasses I've had, and yeah, so we're just going to attach some string, put some little charms on it, I already put together, ah, already put together little I don't know what these are called, but these little things with black beads in them to match the glasses. I got some string hooked on, hooked onto a little, little loop thing, <laughs> and it's just normal black, gray, and white string. I have some pins, or not pins, safety pins and black safety pins. I have some charms and I have some bones. So yeah. So I only have one little string with a hoop on and I need another one because there's two. Anyway, so with the string I go as far as my arm length can go and I get a metal hoop. And I pull and make a little loop with the three strings. Do this. You want some extra string at the end, so then. Yeah. Do this. Not that. There we go. Takes a second, I swear. You don't, when you try and pull in it tight, don't put the pliers inside the metal hoop because it'll open it. So you want to grab the outside, clamp it like this, and pull. I learned that the hard way. So now you got this. So then you go to the end of all the string. And you're going to trim it. It goes like this. So I'm going to double check the length. Both of them. Make sure it's even. And it is a little uneven. Which is not the end of the world. But we're going to trim it. all six pretty much and trim. Now you got two or two loops with string on them. So yeah. Then I'm just going to do a basic braid with these. And yeah. So next I got some bigger loops. And I just looped it around. Let's focus. I just looped it around uh, the little area where you have the tiny screw on the glasses. And we're gonna take this, put it there, and clamp shut. it's all the way closed and there. that'll be easier to braid it then we just take the other one loop it through the holes where the screw goes come out the other side Grab our string, put it on here, and clamp shut. And there. So now you have glasses with string. So now we are going to braid the string. So I'll be back. So I got 
Sorry for the sudden camera angle change. So I got one add one string done. And I did something a little different. So I did a braid and then I did a single knot thing. So how you do the little single knot thing is you take your string, go over, go take one part of the string string, you go over the other two. And then you go under through the loop and you just tighten. And if you do that consistently, it will end up doing like a little swirl around the strings. And yeah, I will show you the completed or partly completed one. So. so it starts with a little braid and goes to the single knots and more braid single knots more braid and just keeps going till it ends with more braid and i ended it with just a single just a simple knot and i added the little jar and the glasses charm and a rabbit charm so yeah so I finished it. It's very uneven, but it's fine. So I'm going to add a few more things. I'm going to add these bones and add some safety pins. So yeah. So I finished making them and added some bones. And some pens to the extra string, and I braided the extra string. Um, is it functional? No. You'd have to, like, fidget with it a whole lot, which I already fidget with my glasses a whole lot. Um, yeah. This is what I've made. Do I recommend ever doing this? Probably not, so if you're just bored, have some broken glasses, as well. I'll probably just hang these on my wall.